ended up on the wrong side of the law after a school dance in Milwaukee this weekend. Police made multiple arrests. Community members are trying to come up with ways to fight youth violence. Fox 6's Sharita Irves with more on their efforts. We just working real hard to get to these teens ears. Squad swarmed to 76 and Good Hope Saturday night. The Milwaukee Police Department says Destiny High School held a dance. Police say some who were leaving began acting in a disorderly manner. Witnesses say a large crowd of juveniles gathered outside of Good Hope Mart. An employee who didn't want to show his face says it's alarming. They are violent. They are. So I have to lock the door. And it's certainly not the first time a group of teenagers had a run in with the law. During the summer, police say a looting incident involving teens happened at a gas station in Milwaukee's River West community. Surveillance video was released. So you have to be loud as you can. Community activist Michael Hagler organized a peace rally after the summer incident happened, as well as others. His group has not put together a peace rally in response to Saturday's incident, but Hagler says he'll keep working to promote peace. I feel like if people let their voice be heard, and people will start understanding what's going on and be able to hear and wake up the city. Hagler created an organization named Team Stop the Violence. This is a group's Facebook page. Community members are coming together to talk about solutions to curb crime. Getting the community more involved, parenting especially, you know, more involved, knowing where your children are, what they're doing, who they're hanging with. Um, I think that's a big start. Organizers say getting youth involved in mentorship programs and providing jobs for them will be beneficial. They realize combating violence is not a quick fix and it's a process, but with all hands on deck, positive results can be achieved. Sharita Irves, Fox 6 News. And total police tell us they made 12 arrests. Milwaukee police.